instead of tutorial, I'm going to show you how to exclude a tag on MailChimp. So the first thing that you would like to do, of course, is just go and open whatever browser you're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. Here in my case, I'm actually using Brave, but of course, in your case, you can use any other browser it could be possibly working for you. Once you open that browser, make sure to go to this URL section and simply type mailchimp.com and hit the enter button and that should take you into this page which is going to be your home screen or your main screen. Of course, if you have an account, you can simply go and click at login into your account so you can actually enter your name or user's name or email, then password, then you can log in into your account. If you don't have an account, you can actually scroll down here and see all the plans that they have. They have the three paid plans and one free plan. Once you choose whatever plan suits you, let's use this as an example, they're going to get you to the section where you can actually create your account. As you can see, let's just click add to this free plan, sign up for free or sign up free. And that should take you here. Simply just enter your email, username and password, then click on sign up. Let me do that and I'm coming back. So now you have to check your email by just going to your email and activate it by the message that they're going to send you. Once you activated your account, you'll find yourself here again. So let's just click at continue free. Here, you'll have just to enter your first name, last name. So let's just enter those that is uh, like suggested for me and click on next. Of course, the phone number is just optional. And here, of course, you'll have to enter your address, thanks and etc. So let's just enter those, click on next. And here, of course, you'll have to answer some questions. If you don't want to, it's cool. You can just keep pressing, pressing and at next, as you can see. But the first one, you should actually just answer it and you will see the rest of them. You can actually cl keep clicking at skip. Once you finish, click on finish. And as you can see, once you click on let's go, you will find yourself on the home screen of the MailChimp website. So as we said in the beginning of this tutorial, we would like to exclude the tag. And of course, if you want to do that, we can simply go and click at created this left panel. Once we are here, we will have to choose as an example the regular email or just click on design email and that should take us actually in this so here let's just of course choose the theme for your email or something like that just choose this as an example and just click at continue i don't want to edit anything at the moment so let's just click at continue of course see close continue and as you can see we are going to be here so now, as we said, we would like to exclude the tag. So if, uh, the only thing that you can do, of course, is just click at add the recipient. Then here, just choose the audience or choose the tags that you have. For me, I have just one tag, so I can just select it. As you can see, you can even choose segments or tag here. You can choose all the subscribers and audience or just group on your segment, new subscribers, active subscribers, or inactive subscribers. Of course, you can click or on this group and a new segment and here go and choose of course you can paste some email address that you want to receive this email and just exclude whatever email you don't want them to receive that email so that's how you actually exclude that once you finish you can simply of course once you fill this you'll find this schedule or send uh, click on whatever of them and you'll be good to go so this will be actually for the tutorial. i hope you like it thank you guys for watching and goodbye